Okay, Lauren, thanks very much. It's 6.03 right now. The number of cases, hospitalizations, and deaths from the coronavirus continues to climb in Maryland. In fact, those numbers have been climbing ever since Governor Hogan announced that statewide restrictions would be eased. That announcement came three weeks ago today. The percentage of people testing positive in Maryland is now at 4.99%. When Governor Hogan made that announcement three weeks ago today, the positivity rate was 3.56%. WMR2 News, Aaron McPherson is live at the state fairgrounds in Timonium with what state leaders are saying about these numbers. Aaron. Good morning, Christian. Well, some state leaders say they're not too concerned right now since most of the people getting sick are the younger population and the death rate is much lower, but people are still dying from this virus. Nine more people were reported dead in Maryland yesterday. Now, the Maryland Acting Secretary of Health said he doesn't want anyone to overreact because even though the numbers are rising, it's fairly flat in terms of growth. He said right now only about three to five percent of the older population is getting sick, but Senator Clarence Lamb the, says the younger population typically gets the older population sick, and even though the death rate is much lower now, it usually increases after a few weeks of increased cases. I'm concerned that deaths are a lagging indicator, so if we're potentially looking at a spike that we are in now, that it will be late, and any action that would be taken um, would be late when it comes to the time that we see a rising number of deaths. Senator Lamb also referenced the Montgomery County Health Officer who said the rise in cases isn't getting the attention needed. He also quoted the CDC director who said she's feeling, quote, impending doom. And he's concerned we're opening faster than we can vaccinate. But other leaders say that everything is on track. They do stand by the state with the reopening process, saying that we are getting people as vaccinated as much as possible with an end in sight. Governor Larry Hogan hoping to have normalcy by Memorial Day, which is just two months away. Reporting live, Aaron McPherson, WMAR 2 News.